Hello, welcome to 2022. This is Juniper Buried Soaps, Jung speaking, and um, we have a new video to present our new friend Japani, Jasmine Bath Bombs. So I thought I'd show you in this video how we do a very simple setup for our photo shoots, especially when it's raining outside and we are forced to take some photos in indoors. So we just use this white uh, large tablecloth. We have some cute little props, and of course you need some extra lighting and a tripod. Our friend Japani is um, it's a floral scented bath bomb. It's a very very pale purple, and on the top we have these lovely uh, jasmine flowers. These dried flowers will just basically float away and kind of cover the top of your bath water and as you can see compared to my hand um, I have medium sized hands I think <laughs> they're pretty good size and our bath bombs are almost seven ounces so they should last maybe 10 minutes um, but we're gonna test one out soon I'm excited to do that uh, in front of you uh, right here on our table. <laughs> this is the second type of bath bomb we have, a bling bomb. This is raspberry jam with rose. On the other side, you could see it with this one. This is the one we're gonna test. This is a little clear plastic capsule that holds the bling or the ring inside. Um, I put that one a little too low um, in the mold. So this one, we're gonna be testing this one out and we're gonna sacrifice this one to show you the fizzing and foaming action of this particular bath bomb. And mm, it smells really, really good. You can really, you can hear the bling rattling around, which is kind of funny. You can hear it in this one too. Um, and th these bath bombs go for a good, I would say at least 10 minutes in the bath. They contain shea butter, cocoa butter, nice avocado oil. Sometimes I use rice bran oil. Really, really nice oils and ingredients. Uh, kaolin clay. They will make you feel, your skin feel very, very um, smooth. That's what I, you know, people have commented about my bath bombs. And moisturized. So it's just not like you know, baking soda and citric acid, which are the, you know, two main ingredients. There's lots of nice oils and moisturizing um, agents in there and, and clay also to make your skin feel fabulous. So why don't we go ahead and test this out? Here we have a little tub of water. I hope you can see. So that is a little side shot. Rose Absolute, which is really precious. Um, type of essential oil. It's like a little bit better than essential oil, actually. So, uh, you wanna you wanna put it in? Yes. Okay, my daughter wants to put it in. So go ahead. Are we are we ready? Hold on. Okay, action. Slowly put it in there. Let it Woo! go. Whoa! It is a floater. Because <laughs> that it, sounds like, gross. Because because it has like a capsule of air in it. Right. Right. So. Foamy. It is, it's foamy. The water is kind of, ooh, it's cold. <laughs> so if you see it, it is, oh, the, oh, God, the, the capsule might just pop out because it's really near the bottom. Yes. So it looks like it's sunk down. It's doing all kinds of things. It's making bubbles. It's turning the water pink. So, yes, there is a beautiful pink color. Now, if you had running water, if you agitate the water with your hand like this, or if you have running water, it will create more of a, of a foam. So, this is actually a very small um, tub compared to your bathtub. So, you will see a little bit more movement in a bigger tub and especially if you have the water running as well then you're going to see more bubbles Ooh. i don't know if you can see anything underneath here it's very pink very pink <laughs> Ooh, look at that that's the capsule right there. 
Yeah, that was really close to the bottom. And you can see the rose. The rose is kind of popping out. Look at that. You can see more of the glycerin rose soap. Yeah. So you can use that glycerin rose soap to um like wash. to wash, yeah. With the washed with the washcloth. Well, you have to make squishy soap. <laughs> <laughs> so let's so I guess depending on the placement of the bubble, sometimes they do, it, if it's off center, it will spin compared to some of our other bath bombs, which I sometimes put um, an embed on the inside. Um, and those embeds like just kind of shoot the bath bomb in different directions. This one's a little bit more calm and it's just kind of gently float, it'll gently float in your tub and release this really beautiful rich creamy foam this smells like really good like roses oh the capsule popped out oh the capsule popped out how much of a bath bomb do we still have look at that it's like a crater <laughs> and look the rose has come out even more it's like almost like it's blooming mm -hmm. so you see the ring is here you can just pop the cap capsule open. okay so try to pop the capsule open. Uh, yep if you squeeze it like with your hands our bling bomb is is not for children but if you want to give it to a child please make sure that they are closely supervised so that they do not swallow the capsule or the ring this is such a cute little ring look at mm -hmm. that it's a little enameled ring and it's half of it's like a little red uh, half a heart and half of it is a white half a heart really cute and just adjustable it's just a play kind of you know fun fashion ring so it's nothing um you know it's nothing like fine jewelry but it is a fun piece and you could certainly wear that it and it looks really cute also the capsule flutes <laughs> <laughs> so now you can really see that rich foam building and it will leave your skin nice and soothed and of course my daughter just mentioned talk about the fragrance and the fragrance is really really good so look now the rose is sticking out even more as the the bath bomb is wearing down and you might see like little darker flecks and that's actually the 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 butters, the shea butter, the cocoa butter, um, and sometimes they cool a little bit faster than the other oils. Oh, my rose fell out. <laughs> so they'll appear a little bit darker. And that's got to be at least now how many minutes? Five minutes? I think this is going to go for another, at least another five minutes. You can really see that foam building. This is a really great sensory experience, relaxing. It's um, very, very fragrant and beautifully fragrant so that it'll make your whole bathroom smell really nice, like raspberry and roses. And at the end, you get a little treat. So it's a nice little surprise. And that is the Juniper Berry Soaps um, Raspberry Jam and Rose Bling Bomb. Look how pretty that color is. And the water is kind of like that, it's like a pretty hot pink in there. The bubbles are very light pink. It's just a really beautiful, foamy lather. Um, and this is all due to the um, the SLSA, which is a very mild surfactant called baby foam, and it is very gentle, but it makes really great bubbles. So check out our um, Juniper Berry Soap Sexy store, and we have a very wide selection of bath bombs going right now um in different varieties some of them have botanicals some of them are made with just essential oils not fragrance oils um some of them uh just you know they spin as well as um, foam and fizz 
um, some videos and a lot of different things. And uh, we'll keep creating wonderful, beautiful bath products for you uh, here on our store. Thank you and uh, have a happy new year. What's so fun playing with them?